We'll split up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then. Hey. I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it, for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <clears throat> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. Uh, yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? I repeat. Okay, I was only trying to help. Oh, before I forget, here's a little something extra for being so brave. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, see you on the train. Couldn't be. But then... You're not real. You're... dead. I am. I killed you with my own... <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. 
Slowly, silently, painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things would be lost. Your hometown, the earth so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me to spare you. The shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world. Which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry. It's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this. Don't let the intruder escape. Security's everywhere. Too weak to save anyone. <laughs> Not even yourself. Are you okay? Hey, are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know. For scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <gasps> Wait! Nice 
nice meeting you. Sword on the ground! Right now! End of the life, Pug! I'm gonna enjoy this! This cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? Public security, the runaround. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> the wind <laughs> thought they were invisible they were at first only saw them after she grabbed me a new shinra weapon maybe <laughs> more like a panic induced hallucination <clears throat> never mind forget i said anything suit yourself come on let's move up A lot of people here. And it's the freight car too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Look at us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train and hold there. Little health cloud, please. I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have sure fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? No, mm -hmm. Shinra wouldn't let that you happen. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. would go so far as to bomb a reactor. <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Mm. Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <gasps> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? J just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion 
was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? <laughs> we will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Them spiting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <coughs> Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. I suppose. There's only one way it can go. <laughs> <laughs> 